recent Avengers, you know Marvel's version of a Tesseract. But it turns out that there's such a thing as a real Tesseract, and it just might be cooler than the one on the big screen. the Tesseract featured in Avengers, real Tesseracts are cube-shaped, but Tesseracts are not three-dimensional cubes. They are in fact four-dimensional. Just like how a cube is essentially a three-dimensional square, a Tesseract is a four-dimensional cube. If I haven't quite blown your mind yet, take a look at this. This is it, a Tesseract or a four-dimensional object. Right about now you might be realizing, wait a second, I can see that and it's obviously three-dimensional. This is where things get a little bit weird. The reason you see something three-dimensional is because your brain can't understand four dimensions. What you see is essentially a three-dimensional picture of a four-dimensional object. It's like if you drew a cube on a piece of paper. The image is two-dimensional, the shape is two-dimensional, but because you've seen a cube before, you're able to picture it in three dimensions. This is the same with a tesseract, except it is a three-dimensional image of a four-dimensional object, something you can't understand. Now, if you thought this was amazing before, check this out. Just like you can rotate a normal cube or square, we can also rotate a tesseract, which looks like this. You might need a little time to get your head around this, but once you do, it's a thing of beauty. Okay, so now that you're starting to understand that, it's time for me to blow your mind once more. You see, we don't have to stop at four dimensions. We can make cube iterations of every number of dimensions. These cubes are called hypercubes. This is the rotation of a five-dimensional hypercube and a six-dimensional one. Higher dimensions look pretty much the same, but with more rods. Finally, check out this three-dimensional hypercube net being folded into a tesseract. If you thought this video was interesting, check out these previous ones. If you want to be informed of new videos, subscribe, and if you have a question or concept you'd like us to cover, leave it in the comments. Thanks for watching.